Hi everyone. Today we are going to learn norm of a vector space and related examples. Norm of a vector space and related examples. Okay, let us start. Norm of a vector space. Norm of a vector space. The length or magnitude of a vector a equal to a1, a2, etc. am is defined by Norm A equal to root of A1 square plus A2 square plus etc. plus A n square. That is the length of a vector is called its norm. That is if we consider the vector A equal to A1, A2 etc. A n then it is norm. That means the length of the vector norm A equal to root of A1 square plus A2 square plus etc. plus A n square. Unit vector. For a non-zero vector A, the process of constructing a unit vector U by multiplying A by the reciprocal of its norm. For a non-zero vector A, the process of constructing a unit vector U by multiplying A by the reciprocal of its norm. That is U equal to A divided by norm A. Okay. Question is, if A equal to 2, 3, 0, 4, minus 1 belongs to R5, then find norm A and unit vector. Then find norm A and unit vector. Okay, given that A equal to 2, 3, 0, 4, minus 1. Given that A equal to 2, 3, 0, 4, minus 1. We want to calculate first norm A. Norm A equal to root of 2 square plus 3 square plus 0 square plus 4 square plus negative 1 whole square. That is equal to root of 2 square is 4 plus 3 square 9, 0 square is 0, 4 square 16, negative 1 square is 1. Adding this we get root 30. Uh, norm A is equal to root 30. Now we want to calculate unit vector. That is equation is U is equal to A divided by norm A. A divided by norm A. Here A is equal to divided by root 30, comma, 3 divided by root 30, comma, 0 divided by root 30, comma, 4 divided by root 30, comma negative 1 divided by root 30. Okay. That is equal to we can write 2 divided by root 30, comma 3 divided by root 30, comma 0, comma 4 divided by root 30, comma negative 1 divided by root 30. Okay. This is the unit vector. 